Hi everyone and welcome to our gospel reflection for this Monday the 4th of April as we begin this fifth week of our Lenten season. We begin in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Today we read from John chapter 8 verses 12 to 20. Jesus said to the people, I am the light of the world. Anyone who follows me will not be walking in the dark. He will have the light of life. At this, the Pharisees said to him, you are testifying on your own behalf. Your testimony is not valid. Jesus replied, it is true that I am testifying on my own behalf, but my testimony is still valid because I know where I came from and where I am going. But you do not know where I came from or where I am going. You judge by human standards. I judge no one. But if I judge, my judgment will be sound because I am not alone. The one who sent me is with me. And in your law, it is written that the testimony of two witnesses is valid. I may be testifying on my own behalf, but the father who sent me is my witness too. They asked him, where is your father? Jesus answered, you do not know me, nor do you know my father. If you did know me, you would know my father as well. He spoke these words in the treasury while teaching in the temple. No one arrested him because his time had not yet come. The Gospel of the Lord. Like last week, we can see Jesus involved in confrontations in the temple. And today we see the Pharisees use a technique that is still used to this day by people who don't want to listen. That technique is that they don't attack what they are being told, but they attack the one who is doing the telling. Jesus refers to two witnesses who live by the law that support his credentials. One is Jesus himself and one is the father. And the Pharisees will not accept this support. It enrages them that anyone claims God as his father. And so again, as we begin this fifth week, we see the anger and hostility building towards Jesus. And again, we hear that the time is not right for his arrest. I think today we can take comfort in the words that we hear in the gospel. If you knew me, you would know my father as well. How well do I know Jesus? In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thanks for joining us for our gospel reflection this morning. Look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Till then, take care. Thanks, everyone. God bless. Mm -hmm.